Hi, ladies. Okay. I, um, sorry, this is such a random time to go live, but I just had a thought and I wanted to share it with you guys. And also, I'm not in my little room because I'm doing some graphics work. So, I'm just going to be kind of working and talking to you at the same time. So, here is, um, the deal. Okay. We need, I wanted to kind of give you a scenario. Okay. Hi, Jennifer. I want to give you a scenario. Let's say I started working at an ice cream shop, okay? And I was like, hey guys, come visit me at my ice cream shop. It's amazing and we have the best ice cream ever. So, okay. So you start working at the ice cream shop. It's day one. How many people are going to come visit you that you know at your ice cream shop? How many people? Zero, right? Zero people are going to come visit you at your ice cream shop. Even though, you know, you really want them to and you have a great product and all these things, zero people are going to come, okay? Now, let's say you work there a week. How many people are going to work at your ice cream shop? I mean, you posted about it one time. Like, everybody knows you work there. So why aren't people coming to your ice cream shop? How many people are going to come see you at your ice cream shop in week one? How many? Maybe one? Maybe, right? And this is with you just posting one time? So what happens if you start posting more? What happens if you're the owner of this ice cream shop? All of these proceeds of this ice cream shop are going directly to you. How many people, how many friends and family? You're posting specials. You're consistent about your sales. How many friends and family are going to come visit you to try out your ice cream? Everybody loves ice cream. Everybody wants it, right? How many people? If you're posting about it, way more. Way more people. So the number one thing that you guys need to think about in direct sales, any direct sales, I don't care if it's makeup, I don't care if it's nail wraps, I don't care if it's oils, the number one thing that you guys need to think about is being consistent. Being consistent. Because if you are not consistent, your friends and family, number one, they're going to buy from somebody else on your friends list. Okay? On their friends list. Because they probably know two people or so that sell unique. Okay? So let's say they know two people that sell unique. How are you going to get their sale? You're working your business. That's how you're going to get their sale. Because people don't want to buy from somebody that's just a fly-by-night, has run 14 direct sales company jobs, and now has decided unique is you know what they're going to do. Who, who wants to buy from somebody like that? No, I want to buy from somebody that this is it. This All their eggs are in this basket, okay? This is what they want to do. This is their plan. This is how they're getting out of debt. This is how they're going to stop that full-time job. That's who I want to buy from. Who do you want to buy from? Do you want to buy from somebody that has posted one time that they've so started selling a product? Oh, I started selling, um, I started selling, um, you know, a wreath. Post about it one time, nobody buys your wreath. Well, why isn't anybody buying my wreath? You posted about it once. How do people going to remember that you even sell these things? You have to be consistent. You have to, have to, have to, have to be consistent. You need to create your, your VIP groups if you want this to work for you. If you don't want it to work for you, then don't post. You're totally fine. You got a kit. You got makeup. Great. Good. You're fine. But you cannot, and I'm not saying anybody in this group has done this, but I'm just saying in general because I've seen it and I've seen people do this in direct sales in general. You cannot say, you cannot join a company, not post, not tell anybody basically that you're selling it, and then expect to, you know, get out of sales and get your car payment paid for, or get out of debt and get your car payment paid for. Does that literally make sense to anybody? Like, does it make sense to anybody? Like, no. Your ice cream shop. It's your ice cream shop. Right? It's your ice cream shop. You need to tell them how great your ice cream is. That's what you need to do.
You need to tell them, your ice cream is amazing. If you are in the market for ice cream, try it. If you don't like it, I will give you your money back after you've tried it. It's okay if you don't like it. Not everybody is going to like ice cream. Not everybody's going to like Unique. Not everybody's going to like the makeup. Not everybody's going to like the mascara. There are people in this group who don't, who haven't, who didn't even like the mascara in the beginning. It's okay. It's okay. Not everything is for everybody. But you need to be consistent. Because what happens is your friends are going to be, or your friends and their friends and their friends, you're not expanding your business. You're not doing parties. People aren't going to take you seriously. Because so many people are in direct sales now. And people only have a certain amount of money. So how do you know that they're going to spend the money on what you're selling? You need to make them want it. You need to be consistent. You need to wear it. You need to love the products. That's how. That's how you make it in this business. If you are consistent with your product, if you are consistent, you will have sales. There is absolutely... No chance that you are going to have zero sales if you are consistent and you are posting about your product. And guess what happens? As soon as you make that first sale, you start getting commission on it. Three hours later, you get your commission. So if you are tight on money, if you are having trouble with anything, if you're having trouble, if you're feeling not that confident, start putting your makeup on every single day. Start posting about your products every single day. In your VIP group, post, let's say, maybe once a week-ish in your, on your Facebook page about Unique. Probably more, but um, however much you want, post about it, okay? <laughs> I'm fired up, Jennifer. I'm fired up today. <laughs> because you cannot, like, if you're having trouble, like I said, if you're having trouble with money or whatever it is, or you can't, you can't make your ends meet, or whatever it is, Work your business. You guys already did the hard part. You already spent the $99. That's the hard part. That's the part that people don't always have. It's people that don't always have the $99 to be spending on the kit. You already did it. You did it. You did that $99. Now, if you work your business, you can make that back in a month. And then anything on top of that is profit. Anything on top of that is profit. Why not? Why not work the business? Why not see where it's getting you? Why not listen to your upline and do what they tell you to do? Why not? Why don't you just try it? And like I said, I'm not saying anybody in this group is doing this, but why don't you try it? And if you then decide it doesn't work for you, okay, that's fine. You don't have to do it anymore. But you cannot come into this business and then decide it's not working for you because you're not working it. That's why it's not working for you because you're not working it. If you work it, it will work for you. I can absolutely a thousand percent guarantee it. Thousand percent. So that's it. So consistency is the number one key. Number one consistency. You have to post in your in your VIP group once a day. If you're doing a launch party or any sort of party, you need to be posting three times a day. Okay? Three times a day. And do them at least two hours apart because you don't want to be bombarding people. Okay? But three times a day. Do it and see if it doesn't work for you. I dare you. I dare you. I dare you. All right, loves. I love you. Talk to you soon. Thanks for watching.